Hi, Kenny Scott here from Hesco Bastion. I'm the product development manager. We've come out to California in between uh, Las Vegas and Los Angeles, right in the middle of these two in the high desert, uh, to test our new barrier which we've designed over the past year. The aim of this barrier is to stop a vehicle, or a hostile vehicle, at 50 mile an hour. The test vehicle is going to come down here and impact the barrier just behind us here. You can see it's a three or four meter barrier, high barrier, it's anti-climb, surface mounted so that means it's not dug into the ground, uh, it's just sat on this sand. This barrier can be used around um, critical infrastructures or key assets, national key assets around the globe. So what we're going to do is we're going to get a truck at the end of this track here, we're going to set it up and we're going to run it down here, we're going to get up to a speed of 50 mile an hour before we impact the barrier. Uh, the truck weighs uh, 6.8 tonnes or 15,000 pounds. It's going to impact the barrier and the key thing we've designed into the barrier is a energy transfer mechanism. So what happens is when the vehicle hits, the millisecond it hits that front of that barrier, the energy has been pushed out either side 90 degrees. That stops the vehicle, stops the barrier from sliding so much. If it was, if it didn't have that, the barrier would just slide. But because we've engineered this thing into it, it spreads it across and involves the whole barrier into the, the collision. Um, so we're going to test this very, very shortly, and we'll we'll keep you updated on progress. I'll now show you the truck which we're going to use. Okay, we've come down to the workshop now. Um, this part is where the vehicle gets prepared for the impact. Uh, we've got a, an ASTM standard vehicle here, which is perfectly road legal. It has to be road legal uh, to be part of the test. An international S1700, which you'd expect to find in the streets of the US. What the guys do here at the workshop is prepare it in one to make sure the weight's right. The weight has to be 15,000 pounds or 6.8 tons. You can see the yellow markers, yellow and black markers on here. This is all part to do with the, the impact assessment and the post test analysis for us at HESCO to see where exactly where the vehicle is impacted, what's happened to the barrier we've designed. So that's, that's the, this vehicle is now ready to go. Uh, like I say, we're going to get up to 50 mile an hour upon impact, and that's where the vehicle meets its makeup. And uh, fingers crossed, we'll pass the test.